I'm uh, Julie Pilot, teaching in uh, uh, for uh, Commission scolaire de Charlevoix. I'm teaching at Le Centre Éducatif Saint-Aubin in Intensive English Sec 1 and 2. Intensive English is a, a school program that we started three years ago. Uh, it's uh, the uh, the student starts uh, learning French, studying French, and then the uh, for the last part of the year they uh, go into English. So intensive for five months, and then when they start over again on the second year, they start in English. So at the end of the two years, they should be able to do their sec four regular core. Uh, because what we heard from the parents and some students as well is that they, they wanted to uh, learn English, to be better in English at the end of their SEC 5. And as Bessin-Paul is a touristic place and they have to speak English to be able to get a summer job, so everything came into one and then we came up with the idea that way. And then I've been teaching for 14 years. In, uh, I'm using technologies in the classroom that I wish I could do more, but that's it. I don't have like lots of experience with ICDs, but uh, I'm kind of uh, starting to use them more and uh, I like it. So I'm working with, uh, I have, there are four computers at the back of my classroom and uh, I have three tablets, but for the purpose of uh, today's project that we'll present later, uh, I have seven tablets, iPad. Uh, pedagogical intention, of course, because uh, is about planning a trip, summer holidays, so uh, the three competencies. C1, interacting, because they had to um, talk about uh, their ideas, the places they wanted to work on, the province or territory they wanted to work on. I can put three. Yeah. Three, one for uh, the activity. And no, 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 three, uh, example, three of the Victoria Park. Uh, it's yeah, yeah, yeah. Three. Yeah, yes, yes, three of the okay. Three for the first, two for the second. Yeah. Which picture do you put? Ah, uh, me. Then random picture. Yeah, for well, this, is it okay? Okay. Yeah, yeah it's okay. It's okay. And also they had to research on the province or territory that they um, they had chosen. So then C2 because they had to research and read and only uh, come up with the um, the relevant information that they wanted to keep. And uh, they had to reinvest everything into uh, a brochure, promotional video and uh, stuff like that. And C3 for the brochure again and the uh, storyboard, uh, the text that they have to write for, that they had to write for the uh, narration and promotional video. Ottawa is the most fabulous city of Canada. It's also an exciting and captivating city with a lot of things to do and kind inhabitants. Ottawa is also named Byton or Oton. It's the capital of the Canada. Ottawa is very near of Kingston. Well, they are, they're always working uh, in uh, tables, groups of four, and um, sometimes they have, of course, there's one tablet per, per table, so I cannot have more, so that's the way I have to work with. And uh, yeah, uh, sometimes, usually they will be split in two, so some will have like a certain amount of time to accomplish a task and then uh, they will switch like the other team will do something and then they switch so the other team can finish the activity on the tablet and the other one is maybe working on the computer or something else so uh, like workshops uh, uh, yeah sharing uh, the uh, technology the devices Oh, and sometimes, yeah, they can bring their own device as well. So, yeah, that's important to mention. I don't know why, and uh, it's a it's a question that all the teachers, I guess, in the school have. Why, when there is technology involved, students are more motivated, they're more focused on tasks, and uh, we have to face it. It's their future, so they have to know how to use it, and I think that uh, the more they use it, the better they become. Uh, half of the team is doing the editing, and the other half is doing the business card. Yes, it's more interesting, it's uh, more fun to use uh, than write down on books and stuff. Um, it's, uh, it's an advancement, I like it. Well, because they're focused on tasks on, on task for sure, they learn more and or they just learn because they, they're on task. So if we build, we prepare a task, that's because there is a pedagogical intention. So we want them to be able to use something and to produce something. 
So at the end, if they, if they go through the whole process, then they will have learned something. And they like to see the results as well, the final products. You know, when they say, okay, today, well, let's see, let's look at your videos or let's look at your uh, book report, the one that you did on Tingling or whatever. They really like to see each other's and uh, like creating an ads as well. It's like, yeah, it's, uh, I think, the final motivation, the final achievement, like uh, watching them and then, oh, that was good, that was... It is more authentic for sure and uh, it gives them something really precious that we don't always have time to do and we should do more, give them feedback because when they see uh, what they did and they can hear themselves, I don't know, they can watch how they, they talk, uh, uh, if they made mistakes, if they next time, oh, I think I'll do that. So it's feedback that usually we don't have time to give them, so it's precious.